Shadows can be faster than light, but nothing can travel faster than the speed of light. Isn't that what Einstein's theory of relativity came down? Oh, a shadow is a form of nothing. Carries no mass, no energy, no data. Two. Was he wrong? Let's do a thought experiment. No. Point a flashlight at the moon. Hold your finger into the beam to cast a shadow. A really Move your finger flashlight. from left to right. If your flashlight was really powerful, you would see your finger's shadow moving over the moon as fast as it moves across the lens. That shadow is moving faster than the speed of light. How can that be? You're just changing its direction, though. Well, the trick is that our shadow is not a moving object. That movement is an illusion, the result of following different shadows created by different photons along a certain path. Kind of like in a nuclear power plant, if you were to change the angle when you insert a control rod, it's going to make the radiation profile and energy profile different throughout the reactor. It just means you're changing direction. You're not actually breaking any laws of physics. Those photons are physical objects that are indeed traveling to the speed of light. But Einstein's speed limit does not apply to the illusions of movement movement they can create. Nothing is faster than light. It's a projection, especially since this is an absence. Therefore correct. We just have to make sure what we're talking about. If you ask a ninja... Huh. Well, there you're just concerned about someone's ability to react to your ninja techniques. 